Flint school teachers and staff will no longer be receiving a 19% pay cut thanks to a brand new agreement. Good evening everyone, I'm Bill Harris. Interim Superintendent Larry Watkins announcing tentative staffing contract agreements this afternoon saying it will save the district millions while avoiding pay cuts. NBC 25's Kyle Mitchell has our top story on how the district will be saving the funds for us tonight. It's all new at 11. Kyle? Bill, the district has to cut about $10 million of its budgets by 2018 under the deficit elimination plan. Flint's interim superintendent says these new agreements with Flint's teachers union, administrators union, and service employees union will make a big difference. Today is a historical day in the Flint Community Schools. The interim superintendent for Flint Schools says the new tentative agreements with the unions will have a lasting impact. This will help us reach our goal in meeting the June 30th, 2018 uh, deadline that the state has given us to come out of this deficit. This is not an, an ordinary negotiation and this is not a typical contract. Teachers say the agreement will avoid the 19% pay cut that was laid out in the deficit elimination plan. This agreement encompasses the issues of wages, salary, benefits and working conditions that are uniquely tied to a new education and staffing plan. We've been able to do that through reductions, redesigning our health insurance plans, ancillary insurance plans, you know, looking at our staffing in each building uh, and being able to adjust staffing there. The agreement with all three bargaining units will save $6.2 million during the upcoming fiscal year. If we save $5 million with the teachers today, that's a, that money is reflected next year as well. Each union will now vote on the tentative agreement, then it will go to the school board for final approval. Live in the newsroom, Kyle Mitchell, NBC 25 News. Bill.